hizi za bodi kwa mchuko tayari bila shaka kabisa bodi kubwa imepoa tuko tayari haya kuna tuzo za wazi ambazo mwanzoni tulizisema miongoni mwa tuzo hizi ni za mshindi wa nne, mshindi wa tatu, mshindi wa pili, wa kwanza lakini pia na mfungaji bora uh, wa ligi kuu ya bora kwa Tanzania bara kwa msimu huu. Kwa nafasi ya kipekee naomba ni wakaribishe uh, wageni wetu hapa mbele waweze kuwatunuku baadhi uh, ya tuzo hizi nne uh, kama sio tano za wanzi za moja kwa moja. Na naomba mheshimiwa mgeni rasmi Waziri wetu Selemani Jafu karibu sana pamoja nayo wapatane na rais wa Tefa wa Alexaria lakini pia na mtendaji mkuu wa Borecom Madam Linda karibu sana. Tuwapigie makofi tafadhali. Naomba tuwakaribishe katika eneo la kati and now ladies and gentlemen we are ready for the awards ceremony. Now Mshindi wa nne wa Vodacom Premier League msimu 2019-2020 na Mungu FC. Pia kipia tusisahau wamefika mpaka finali eh, ya kombe la shirikisho la Azam Sports na wewe ndio msemaji wao. Karibu sana. Makofi tafadhali. Nitoa mikono. Na sasa ungesimama katikati katikati ya rais na zawadi yetu ndio hiyo inakuja jukwani hivi sasa mabibi na bwana Ladies and gentlemen in fourth place in the Premier League Tanzania the ending season na Mungu FC now on stage about to receive their award Christine, please if okay here. Now, Kapiti Mgeni Rasmi. Shilingi milioni kumi za kitanzaniwa. Safi kubisa. Nomo wote tuwe tumeishika. Shaki here. Ongera sana. Ongera ni sana. Na ongeza ni bigi. Bila shaka. Na fasa ni metafu ni kwa niwelo na kika mwa. Vodokon Premier League, F-12 na kuminatisa, F-12 na ishirini. Azam Football Club. Raja Prashid. Kwa pigema kofi Azam Football Club. Kwa mwenye nae namba tumkaribishi mwakilishi kutoka Azam FC. Hakika hiyo ni kiasi gani? Milioni 30. Milioni 32. Ongeleni sana. Na msimu na msimu mingapi sasa kwenye Premier League hasa? Ah, hasa wa Kongwe. Kweli? Eh, wa Kongwe. Tangu okay. bande hawajawe kushuka. Safi kabisa. Na wamewahi pia kuchukua ubingwa ligi kuu ya Bora kwa Tanzania bara kwa msimu mmoja. Safi kabisa. Nashukuru kwamba tunaangalia pia matangazo hayo moja kwa moja. Asante. Tunashukuru sana msemaji mkuu wa Azam FC, Abdul Karim Amin, maarufu kama Popat. Lakini pia tuko na tuzo ya mshindi wa pili hawa ni Yanga uh, Yanga Africa popote pale walipo Yanga Sports Club na tutazame kwanza mshindi uh, wa pili. Na ni picha hapa moja hiyo. Tumeona makamu mwenyekiti wa Yanga Frederick Lamek Mwakalemela lakini pia pamoja na katibu msome ambao amepatana kuja kuchukua tuzo hii shilingi milioni 40 uh, 45 tu za kitanzania. Hongere sana. sema wao wataendelea kupambana kuitafuta nafasi ya pili mpaka mwisho. Mwisho wa bahati mbaya ndio hivyo hesabu zilazimika mechi tano zikiwa zimesalia za ligi kuu ya Bodo kwa Tanzania bara ndipo bingwa kapatikana Simba wakitangaza ubingwa huo mapema na sasa ndio ma champion wa msimu huu wa ligi kuu ya Bodo kwa Tanzania bara Simba Sports Club. Makofi tafadhali kwa mapingo wakati huo pia tunawakaribisha wakilishi kutoka uh, Simba Sports Club na muona Haji Sande Manara semaje lakini pia kwa kuna karibu 
sana Simba wa Yuda bila kumsahau Abdullah try again and Salim Salim Abdullah Mohene try again karibu sana Makofi tafadhali kwa mabingwa Makofi mengi sana kwa mabingwa na sio mabingwa wa kombe moja tu peke yake umeshinda mm, mataji matatu matatu msimu huu yes ngawe jamii kwa shirio mkubwa wa msimu lakini pia ligi kuu ya bora kwa Tanzania bara na kombe la shirikisho milioni 100 yes hongera sana kwa Simba Sports Club ladies and gentlemen representing the champions Simba Sports Club in first place Season 2020 of the Vodacom Premier League. Nam na tashkuru pia heshimi omgeni rasmi kwa na fasi kipeke tukombe pamoja na raisi na mtenda jipu mweza kurejia tena kukawa katibu tuka tenendelea mwosu mwagina. Sati ya ni sana. Mbako wafita padhali. Samani sana naomba ni seme neno tunatoa milioni kumi sio sita Au, safi ya misa Sana ungezeka Karibu sana otuwe neno tafadhali Na nanyongeza hiyo bila shaka medi hata sikitika kamisa Nikweli kwa niyaba ya medi kagere Mfungaji bola wa Premier League Goda kum Premier League Afumbili kuminatisa na afumbili na ishirini Eh, siwezi kuwa msemaji kwa maana ya kuzungumza nchi ambayo yeye angeweza kuyafikiria lakini la msingi ni kwamba natoa shukurani zote hasa kwa timu technical bench na hasa wachezaji wenzake naamini si pekee ambaye alikwenda kuweza kufanikisha ufungaji huu alishirikiana na wenzie ambaye kwa njia moja au nyingine waliweza kufanikisha swala hili kwa kwa niaba yake na wapa pongezi wote waliohusika kwa kufanikisha yeye kuweza kufanikisha kuwa mfungaji bora asante Shukran sana meneja Patrick Raymond meneja wa Simba Sports Club ambaye kuchukua tuzo uh, kwa niamba ya Medi Kagere ikiwa ndio tuzo uh, ya mwisho ya wazi kwa usiku huu tuzo ya mfungaji bora wa ligi kuu ya Bore kwa Tanzania bara msimu wa 2019 2020 na msimu ambao umemalizika 2019 2020 tuzifahamu timu zinazo shindanishwa Mm, tuzo yenye nidhamu wako uh, Kostoliuno ni wagosi wa Kaya hao kutoka Tanga Kagera Sugar wanasuka kurukumbi kutoka kule Kagera pamoja na Mwadui Football Club kutoka kule Shinyanga na naomba nimkaribishe eh, kwa nafasi ya kipekee meneja ya mauzo uh, na masoko kampuni ya magazeti kutoka magazeti ya serikali huyu eh, January Smaganga karibu sana uweze kutuambia ni timu gani ambayo ina nidhamu msimu huu uh, 2019 2020 tafadhali tumpigie makofi Okay, utaifungua tafadhali na twende twende moja kwa kwenye microphone ili uweze kutusomea. Ladies and gentlemen, the nominees and the winner for the most disciplined team. Mshindi ni Kagera Sugar. Tunawamuzi ya mbona chazesha 
kwa Tanzania bara waamuzi wakati lakini pia uh, wasaidizi ila kuna mechi ambayo uh, waamuzi hao walifanya kazi nzuri uh, na kazi kubwa kweli kweli tunakumbuka kwamba moja ya changamoto ambao msimu huu ligi yetu ilipitia ni kelele malalamiko uh, kutoka kwa baadhi ya waamuzi na ilikuwa wakati mpaka TFF sasa ilibidi watu etamko yes kwa hiyo uh, pengine tuone uh, seti hii uh, bora ya waamuzi Yeah, tupige makofi jamani tafadhali. Lakini pia tukukaribishe Kemi Mtahaba kutoka uh, nyumba ni cho aweze kuja kwa zawadi ya waamuzi wetu ambao ni Abdullah Mwinyi Mkuu lakini pia uh, tunaambiwa penda mchache Muhammad Mkono pamoja na Athumani Nazi. Karibu sana mwana dada Kemi. Karibu sana kwa makofi tupige makofi tafadhali. Kitu kimoja nimegundua kuhusu seti hii hapa wote walikuwa wamenyoa kipara siku hiyo na walipendeza sana. Na wanafanya kazi moja sana. Tafadhali tuletewe na nikipenda pia tuzo yetu uh, hao ambao wana wametajwa hapa seti bora na wenyewe waweze kujongea Abdallah mwenye mkubwa kote pale ulipo kar... katika jambo lolote na kwa mara nyingine tena msimu huu uh, tuzo ya heshima inatolewa kwa nani na kwa nini anapewa atakuja kusikia hapa lakini kwa heshima na taandima naomba nikukaribishe rais wa shirikisho la soka Tanzania wale askaria karibu sana tumpige makofi jamani Karibu tajemana tuzo hii ni ya siri haina wale wanaoshindanishwa 
hii haiwezi kushindanishwa <laughs> hii ni heshima sana yes. ya kutukuka haswa tunasubiri kwa hamu basha haitakikuvuja yes habari za jioni mshindi wa tuzo ya mchezaji wa heshima ni sande manana oh Cases of COVID rising. I had to go back home. 
and every day, every now and then, my family would push me to go for training. I once posted a video where I was just doing my training just within the yard. It was because of them always reminding me of my work. So I thank them, I thank all my friends, my fellow footballers, and also I thank everyone who's doing their best in terms of developing football. For me, football is my career, football is my life. Hence, I want to thank everyone who's doing their best to promote football and to develop football. I'm not that good in Swahili, but I've been uh, good at least in understanding when someone is speaking Swahili. Our boss here said something like, we need to appreciate people like Haji Manara. Uh, in a, it wouldn't carry so much weight. I think it's uh, only right that uh, we appreciate such people because if you sit down and look at everything that they are doing, they are promoting football. Those Balakampenja people, they are promoting football. And for me, everyone who's doing great, everyone who's promoting football, I think deserves respect and I thank you all in Jesus' mighty name. Shama hapo hapo tafadhali tunaomba usalie MVP wetu siku huu amesikia hapa na shukuru watangazaji akiwemo Baraka Mpenja na amekuwa akiandika pia kwenye kurasa zake za mitandao kijamii akimpongeza na Azam TV pia kuna kitu imekuwa ndani hapa upate hisia na ukumbuke kile ambacho kilikuwa bora kwako msimu huu Tuangalie screen zetu Jisikia mtaalamu ndio huyu tupo si mwamba wa Lusaka mtu akongo kwa pia ameenda kichwa kichwa akamwambia njoo shikamo kaka Marhaba Habib, chama kachia. Udafi nao ndio kichwa kichwa. Hoi ni mtabani. Chini. Watu wawili, wewe ni chama kweli. Si chama cha kisiasa. Angalia taarifa hiyo. Mali sana. Raha nini yani bwana Simba? Amemgeuza na kugundua parking pass. Mtabani kwa kweli. Oh wow. Wow. Bonde la Togo. Unamfuata chama kichwa kichwa. Takufa kanda. Mashabiki kiraa duniani. Angalia ameitingisha. Akaambia njoo. Chocolate, ice cream. Oh, sambusa ameachia. Chama anaivuta. Anaangalia. Ana drive weka kila pass. Pass ya kimauaji kweli kweli chama Kratos. Nani kama yeye? Huyu ni fundi wa kandanda. The brain. Angalia hapo chama. Kwa kimo majaribu ku drive. Wapi? Usifuate mashuti kama hayo. Sniper wa Zambia. Triple C. Alimchungulia goalkeeper amekaa kichwa kichwa. Amezumba zumba hivi. Akaashia shuti kale mbalo. Asingeweza kulifuata. Kiuno ni muhimu hapa. Uh, I hope to, uh, and uh, uh, I hope and uh, think uh, they, they, they also like agree with uh, the award that I've got and they are happy for me. Achama, there is something that people have been asking about. Uh, the contract of you in the club that you have reached the, the end of the contract. Do you have any offers around or do we expect to see you in next season wearing Simba jersey? Well, professionally, I don't think I can talk about uh, contractual issues uh, right now. Uh, we just hope for the best. I'm still with Simba, so we hope for the best. In case you go to any offer, maybe around your table. Like, like I said, you can't talk contractual issues at this particular moment or at this event. Asante. You win all, all the awards. What things you can say about the talent of Tanzania? Well, the, the talent is quite there. I think uh, if, you are, if you are a new follower of football, you agree with me. We have talent in the Tanzanian Premier League and all we need is support, all we need is to push ourselves and all we need is uh, to know what we want, to remain focused and uh, make sure we keep our dreams alive so that uh, we reach our limits. Thank you. Thank you, Chama. Na washukuru tu wachezaji wenzangu kwa juhudi waweza kuzifanya toka mwezi wa msimu na kuweza kutimiza malengo ya klabu yetu kwa msimu huu. Tunaona tukawapenza wengi wapo na wapenzi wa Simba kwa jumla msimu mpya wa 
kwanza ni niwashukuru ma, mashabiki wetu niwashukuru sana kwa kwa jitiada haya mafanikio yote niwazungumzia sasa hivi ambao walopita naamini ni, ni wao ni, ni, ni moja sababu kubwa sana sikuweza kufikia mafanikio haya yale malengo tuliojiwekea naamini na wao walikopo ni sehemu ya kwa support ili sose, sisi tuweze kufikia malengo haya kwa hiyo nawashukuru sana mashabiki wetu ni, ni, ni seme wa, wajiandae tena kwa msimu unaokuja waweze kupata support kubwa zaidi ya hapa ili tuweze kufanya vizuri zaidi ya msimu pia. Asante sana. Ah tunzo kama hizi basi mchokipata Mwenyezi Mungu alichojalia basi nashukuru Mwenyezi Mungu. Uh, usajili wako ndani ya klabu ya Yanga umezungumzwa sana na watu wengi sana naweza nikasema waliutabiri kwa sababu kuna kipindi ambacho ulitajwa kuwa na thamani ya shilingi milioni miya moja. Labda ile ilikupa uh, tunasema motisha kiasi gani kuweza kupambana na mpaka leo hii kuweza kuwa nominated kwenye hizi uh, tuzo? Eh hey, usajili wangu kwamba kwa mwisho milioni ni mia lakini kwamba si kwamba kukata kujibwetesha au kukata kuzidi kujiona kwa mnyeto nishafika bado mimi bado sijafika kabisa na hizo nilopata hizo ni ndogo kwangu na na hakika msimu unaokuja basi naweza kupata nyingi zaidi ya hizo kocha uh, uh, Juma Mgunda amesema kwamba hakuwa kocha wako tu bali alikuwa baba wako kutoka ligi daraja la kwanza mpaka uh, Premier League labda alikuwa na mchango mkubwa kiasi gani kwa wewe kuweza kupata mafanikio haya ambayo tunayaona kwa sasa kuna sio kama solo ndo za pale kale timu sio ndo kama sio kocha wetu tu basi ni baba yetu mlezi ambao kuna mimi kanlea ndo kwa mpo mdogo mpaka nipofika hapa na changamoto yetu kufikia basi ni yeye ndo anaweza kunifikia mpaka nimefikia hapa na mshukuru mwalimu kwamba siwezi kumwacha na yani masirano yote anaweza kusaidiana nayo kuweza kukupa ushauri jinsi ninavyokwenda na mpaka ninapokaa mpaka sasa hivi sana wewe inatajwa project ya timu fulani inaweza ikamvutia mchezaji. Ulitajwa na Simba, ulitajwa na Yanga. Wengi wakiangalia mazingira ya Simba ndiye ambaye anaonekana kuwa bora lakini ukachagua kwenda Yanga. Ni kipi hasa ambacho kilikuvutia kwa upande wa Yanga? Mchezaji sina timu. Ninachoangalia ni masla yangu yakiweza kukaa vizuri basi mimi naweza kucheza. Sio Yanga ala sio Simba. Hata ngakuja na Mungu mingi kwa masla yangu ngakuwa vizuri basi ningekwenda. Kwa maana kwa majibu sasa uh, mepesi ni kwamba uh, dau la Yanga lilikuwa bora kuliko lile la Simba tembele zilifika. Ana maana anapaka maana kwa moja haijafika imefika moja tumeweza kwenda kule sehemu nye. Sehemu usika. Ah namshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa kwa klabu yangu kuondoka na tuzo nyingi. Ni kama ulikuwa usiku wa Simba tu. Ni kama zile tuzo zetu za Moa Awards. Mashinda tuzo nyingi kuliko kawaida na sema unyesha ukubwa wetu lakini namshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu na washukuru na chama na washabiki wetu kwa kutunga mkono. Na pili eh, na sisi tu kama wale wengine nimefurahi kwa mzee wangu kupata tuzo hii nzuri akitambulika kama tuzo heshima nadhani ana deserve kwa sababu ameufanyia kazi mpira tunaotumikia. Ah mimi sizungumzie leo nazungumzia furaha leo mambo ya utopolo wachana. Chama of course ni mchezaji ana deserve kushinda hii tuzo no doubt. Ana uwezo mchezaji mkubwa yuko vizuri na amefanya kila kitu. Hakuna mtu hata mmoja aliyoguna hapa yani tuzo zimetoka kwa halali. Same 99.9% tuzo za leo zilikuwa za zimekwenda vizuri wamejitahidi sana TFF. Hakuna sehemu ambayo wamepinda pinda goli bora limestahili kiungo bora amestahili beki bora amestahili goalkeeper bora amestahili mchezaji bora chipkizi amestahili kila kitu kimeenda sawa Carry my story live Bonyeza hapa kusubscribe na bonyeza hapa kwenye alama ya kengele ili usipitwe na video mpya